how I hit the shot. I don't know what the shot is. I just go. Just find that deep inside, make it happen, and then ride like crazy, huh? Of course. <laughs> it's going to be a Princeton versus Lockhaven battle. You don't see that too much in the yeah. semifinals at the NCAA tournament. You know, both of you guys' programs have been on the rise. <laughs> Princeton has gone from scoring zero points to EWAs to a record point total this last year. I mean, how's important for, for schools like you to get guys into here? I mean, this is what we've been working for since Coach Harris joined the coaching staff at Eaton, came on as a head coach. And, you know, my brother, he was one of Coach Harris's uh, recruits. He was one of Coach Harris's athletes. And the program's just come miles from there. Um, and, and this is where we're stopping, right? We're looking to get multiple guys at the top of the podium. Right now, you know, it's just place. I'll place again this year. We'll get three guys placed next year, then five, seven, eventually all ten of us. And, and it's, just, it's just been a constant work ethic and an exciting work ethic at that. That rubber knee he had, man, that was, yeah. was hard to finish on. Right. They're tough in all positions, the Mizzou guys. Were you frustrated? Were you, were you worried about the potentially dangerous call on that? You stuck with it on a couple of them. They, 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 they bailed them out a couple of times, but getting the last takedown, riding hard, how important is it? It, yeah, it's important. I really wish I could have gotten that, that reversal because I knew that was going to happen. Coaches watch film. They told me he had a rubber knee. They told me that was coming. Uh, all in all, I should have expected it. I should have gotten out. If I, if I could replay that and do that again, that's what I would have done. Just got out, got my one. But then again, I probably would have relaxed and I wouldn't have got that takedown in the finals. And that's not the way you want to wrestle. You want to be grinding the whole time. Uh, so at the end of the day, I'm glad the match played out that way and I definitely learned something from that situation. How crazy is he can just let it fly tonight? You know, yeah. Sorensen just got knocked off. You got Perry who's talking directly to you right right now. I mean, this is gonna be awesome. Oh These yeah. are two schools that are not traditional powers, right? Going at it. Not everybody had you guys punched into the semis. I'm not gonna lie to you, right? But you know, what's that like? The pressure's off for you. You're all American again. You want that national title? Oh yeah. What's it gonna be like tonight for you? It's gonna be fun. Yeah. I, nobody wants to wrestle with a ball of nerves. Uh, and, and you know, I've wrestled like that before. It just sucks. And I'm out here to have a good time. I mean, look at this crowd. This is incredible. In my home state, I'm originally from Ohio before I went to Blair. Um, it, it's incredible. And my mom's whole family's out here. They're from the, this part of Cleveland. Um, I'm just pumped, man. I'm just pumped. Well, you know I'm an Ohio guy. You're oh, Ohio. I know. I know. You talk as if you were a low guy, right? Yeah. Uh, I mean, this is going to be I remember you, junior high states. <laughs> right? Yeah. It's crazy, though, to look at your development up. You know, you went to Miami Valley Day Country School for mm -hmm. a year. You're an Ohio State champ, prep national champ for Blair. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's incredible. Princeton, you know, your brother went there. He blazed, blazed the trail, as you said. He was one of Coach Eric's first guy, first recruiting classes through, right? And, and uh, is he here? Is your brother yeah, here? yeah, yeah, I just saw him. Daniel, right? Yeah. That's crazy. It's, yeah, it's amazing. It's surreal, honestly, because you look back, and you were always aiming for this part, and you're always aiming higher. You just take a second and see how far we've come. I'm grateful. I'm thankful to God. I'm thankful to my family, and I'm thankful to my coaching staff. I, I, I don't think there's any other better way to, way to live right now. Thank good luck tonight. Thank you.